Alright guys, we're going to install the USB driver for your printer before we install the software. So we'll come over here to Mimaki's global website which is Mimaki.com. Right over here on the top you'll have product. Click on product and then you'll see on this right side of the screen it'll have a list of all the Mimaki products and printers. So we'll scroll to our printer which is going to be a UCJV300. And once we're here at this screen, we'll go to downloads right here. And then over here in this bottom, now we have uh, profiles. So if we're gonna download our profiles for our printer, we have our driver and utility right here. Click driver and utility. We're gonna look for the latest version, depending if your operating system is a 32-bit or 64-bit you would drive, um, install the appropriate driver. In this case, it's gonna be a 64-bit. So we're gonna install this one, click it. Here's a drop-down with all the supported products and the supported um, operating system. Scroll all the way down, click download to start your download for your Mamaki driver. While this downloads, we can also come back over here up top Click download again, and then you have your profiles. Right here, you're gonna select which model you have, depending on the size of the printer. In this case, we're gonna go with the 160. We're gonna choose if we are, have it inked up four color, six color, or eight color. In this case, we have an eight color with clear and primer, and select your ink type, LUS 170. Right here in this page, uh, for the UCJV300, and it's the same for any printer in Mimaki. We're gonna come here to manufacture, and then select your media manufacturer. In this case, we're gonna do some generic ones, so we're gonna go with Mimaki, and then it's gonna give me all the different profiles that uh, Mimaki has for this printer. Here we're looking for a glossy PVC, so we'll use these. Each one has its different resolution. And then we'll do a matte also. And then scroll all the way down. And then download check files. Click download. It'll start your download down here. And let's start your uh, download for software, depending on which version you choose to use, whether it's Rastering 6 Plus or Rastering 7, which is the latest. We'll start with 6 Plus and go through that installation. Click Download. And then here you have um, Download Tool for Rastering 6 Plus 2.13 Full Installer. Go ahead and click that. Here are the specifications that you need for the computer. Scroll down, click Download start downloading go to my folder Mimaki driver I'll extract the, the files go ahead and open it up go over here to setup go ahead and click yes and here just follow the setup menu click OK let it do its install sometimes these are already installed Next, accept the license agreement from the Maki. Install. All right, it is finished. At this point, you can go ahead and connect. We're gonna restart later because we're gonna install the software. It's important to restart your PC after you do the installs. So now we have our USB installed. This is the download tool for 2.3. So we're going to open it and actually here you click download and it'll start to download um, the software install, just like a CD package. Okay, once your installer has uh, finished downloading, click OK and select a saving folder. In this case, we're going to do this desktop folder, RL6. And now it has saved in there. I'll go ahead and exit out of this downloader. Uh, actually, come back in here 
and then here's my install packet for Restlink. Click OK. And here is as if you had the CD installed, but with the latest version. So we're going to go ahead and click Install Rasterlink 6 Plus version 2.13. If you're doing an update, you can update your version of Rasterlink also here. Make sure the USB is uh, disconnected. And it'll begin installing. Click OK. Agree. Install. Setup failed because I already have it installed. Just click close. And you go ahead and click OK here and start the install process. It'll be an install. Click next. Accept the license agreement. Click next. The saving folder. Click next on your C drive. Click install. All right, once you're finished installing, go ahead and click finish. And it'll ask you to restart your PC. We'll do that later. Now your Raster Link 6 is installed.